I'm Sylvia Palacios Whitman. I live here in Warwick, New York, and we are sitting outside of my house, and uh, I'm going to be showing you inside in this tiny little <laughs> room <laughs> filled up with crazy stuff that I have, uh, what I'm going to be showing at the Whitney, and show you my notebooks, and show you some pieces that I have there, even, even perform a little bit for you some of the yeah, two pieces, the tail and the cup, and the hands, the hands are going to be hanging in the Whitney, so... Maybe you can just sort of say, like, so let's go inside. All right, let's go inside. <laughs> I have a million notebooks, yes. I planned, I planned everything in my notebooks. Oh, the stairs, the hands, look at this. I didn't even notice what's here. Mm. I think that extension of my own hands. I, I think that, I mean, you can open your arms and dance and in performance, you know, you can do a lot of stuff. But it, it, what if you have an enormous hands, an enormous face, an enormous, you know, I, I like that idea that you can change yourself, that you can, it, it becomes part of you. This is, this, this is, uh, I show you the pictures, I used it as an extension, in the back of me, there was a, um, a cloud inside of a, an enclosed situation, ready to go. And I come out like this, like this. As a child, I used to do my performances for the maids, for the, for the dogs and the cats. Use my, use my aunt, my old aunt was my, my big star. And, and then um, I, this I used because I made my drawings and then I went for them. You know, it came to my head. See, this was the original idea for what you're going to eventually see. I thought maybe if I had a big vacuum and people can be moved up from the vacuum, I always, it was always impossible what I wanted to do. I decided to actually do it for real with the, what are these things called? Uh, pulley, pulley. Yeah. with pulley, and a friend of mine was helping me, and he hung about 10 people. Ah, this was slingshot. I actually did do this, look, for real. They had the drawings, and here it is happening. And these people were really slingshot into this very soft wall that I, I had built with um, bed stuff and and. I don't know, but, but it was a little dangerous to do it, but people did it. So I will show you this, but in order to show it to you, because all this was always done in enormous spaces, and I had smoke coming out of the cup. My idea was that the smoke from the tail was smoking to the back, and the cup was smoking up. So it was like a shh, very nice stuff. All right, so I just walk with the, with the cup, and it's tremendous amount of smoke. I have it ready to go. <clears throat> what I do is I walk out of the room, pulling the cup out. We just did performances one after another, and we all used the same space, and there weren't all that many spaces to use. And I did many different stuff. I didn't just do art. We went, there, was, there were so many parties and dance parties, and, and people really got very into the party mode and, and drinking and, and doing all kinds. I mean, just wacko. I, I, I don't even know what to tell you. It was living. <laughs> 